Hi, hello, how are ya? Chef Kennedy here. For the rest of December, I'll be sharing my favorite holiday cookies. Today, I'll show you how to make snickerdoodles. This recipe is so special to me because it's a veganized version of my Nana's recipe. These fluffy cloud-like cookies are coated in cinnamon sugar and baked to perfection. The combo of cinnamon and sugar is a batch made in heaven. Okay, so this is everything you'll need for the snickerdoodles. And we're gonna start by taking two tablespoons of cornstarch with three tablespoons of cold water. And this is gonna be our egg replacer. Mix that up, then add in one and a half cups of sugar, mix that together. Now add one cup of room temperature butter. Use a fork, a hand mixer, or a stand mixer to cream together the butter and sugar. And then we'll set that aside while we work on our dry mix. So we'll take two and three quarter cups of all-purpose flour, two teaspoons of cream of tartar, one teaspoon of baking soda, half teaspoon of salt, and mix that up. Now you're going to add your wet to your dry and mix it together using a spatula at first and then just get in there with your hands. Now press together the dough and cut it in half. And then you're gonna form each half into a disc shape and wrap it tightly in plastic wrap. Chill it in the fridge for at least four hours. Time for a dance break. Okay, so now we're gonna take two tablespoons of sugar, two teaspoons of cinnamon, and mix that up. This is gonna be what we roll our cookies in. So now remove the cookie dough and you're gonna take about a heaping tablespoon of cookie dough per cookie. It should be about a walnut sized amount. Now place that onto a parchment lined sheet tray and we're gonna roll each cookie until they're nice and smooth and shiny, just like this. Now roll each cookie ball into the cinnamon sugar mixture and we're gonna bake this at 400 degrees for eight minutes. When they come out, your kitchen is gonna be smelling fantastic and each cookie is gonna be perfectly caramelized on the bottom. Okay, so here we have our snickerdoodle cookies and let's just take a moment to appreciate the dome shape we have going on here. That means it's gonna be a cloudy cookie. Wow. Ooh, these cookies are simply the best. They are perfectly buttery and soft on the inside. Nice crisp crunch of the sugar and cinnamon on the outside. Literally, if I had one cookie for the rest of my life, it would be these babies, Nana's Snickerdoodles. Okay, well don't forget to like and subscribe. From my kitchen to yours, Chef Kennedy, out.